The spring signing period continuing around the Quad Cities with a pair of Mac schools taking center stage this afternoon. Let's start at Davenport North where 15 Wildcat standouts made their college intentions official. Seven different sports were represented on this day including a trio from both football and softball. All-state defensive tackle Dominic Wiseman will be a preferred walk-on at the University of Iowa next season. It's a path that several Quad City athletes like Brett Greenwood and Jake Gervas have thrived in. Wiseman ready to prove he belongs at the next level. I wanted to play at the highest level and I feel like COVID kind of snubbed me from actually having to offer at the highest level. So when Iowa offered me the, uh, the preferred walk-on, I was just thinking about it. It always lingered in my mind. And then after playing, I was like, yeah, I, I just got to play at the highest level. Like I want to be the kid that was from Davenport North and they see on the TV once, like once I earn my spot. And I know, I know I can do it. I mean, it just shows how much improvement we've made like over the years. Like, from I've grew up with mostly all these people signing today, so like going from youth sports to signing now, it just shows like how much Davenport North is like a big program now, and like how much we've improved. You can see a full list of who's heading where right now on the sports page at wqad.com. Let's go over to Pleasant Valley High School. 19 student athletes are ready to take their talents to the next level. This group, headlined by three to the Division One level, Elizabeth McVeigh will run track and cross country at San Diego. Ayla Urson will row at Boston University. Jack Streppy will take his soccer talents to Illinois Chicago. A big day and relief for everyone involved. Yeah, for sure. I mean, it's a long process. It's hard. It's difficult and um, just cool to be done with it and have a place to go that I really like. I'm really thankful. I mean, my parents put in a lot of effort, a lot of time, a lot of sacrifice on their part as well, not just my part. And so um, their effort was really appreciated and as well as the coaches that really took the time to help me develop. I'm thankful for all the supporters I've had and the people that have given the opportunities to put in that hard work um, and, make, and make this day and make this dream of mine happen. It's a great environment, great people, great coaches in a great area. Uh, winning mentality. Um, I want to compete for a national championship, and they've got it right there. To see a full list of all the Spartans and where they're going next year, check out that sports page at WQAD.com. A relief for everyone, yeah. parents included. Just to be done with it, you never yes. think about that. It's been stressful yeah. for these kids. It's very exciting for them.